yesterday. I drove home after work. This morning, I woke up a little late. Becky had to call me as my alarm clock. Now we're on our way to the airport to head to the wedding. As you can tell, I still haven't had coffee this morning. We need to get some, like, ASAP. Back to recording on our camera. Thank goodness, huh, Lunks? <laughs> yeah. So today is actually a very bittersweet day because today is the day that I leave for the wedding. Mark is already on his way. He should be getting on the plane pretty soon. Um, and then I'm leaving here around lunchtime. So I'm excited to see Mark and to go celebrate and go to the wedding, but I'm not very excited to leave Amelia. She was invited to this wedding, and I originally had planned to take her, but... What's the matter? Oh, I know. You're okay. Okay, so as I was saying, I was originally going to take Amelia with us to the wedding because she was invited. But then I started thinking about it, and Amelia's at the age where she wants to be down 24-7. She wants to be crawling around, and she doesn't really want to be held, and that just didn't sound a wedding doesn't sound like the right place to do that at so i think it's best for amelia to stay back here where she's comfortable and has her bed and all of her toys and can go play at the park and the backyard rather than sitting in a hotel room so that's why she's staying back but it still sucks huh, boo -boo. are you gonna miss mama you gonna miss mama Nothing. Nothing. Alright, I'm awake, I'm awake. But we didn't have coffee, we had two mimosas and a shot of Patron. And now take a look at me. I'll take it. Okay guys, I'm officially off. I just had to say goodbye to Poochie, so... I know she's in good hands, but it's still the first time that I've ever left her, so it's really, really hard on me. But I'm not going to talk about it because I'm already starting to get teary-eyed. But anyways, I'm headed out. I'm off to Mark's house because I'm going to carpool with their family. Mark should actually be landing in Ontario in about 30 minutes, and then it's about a 45-minute drive to the venue from there, so he's just going to catch an Uber. And it's about a two-hour drive from our house, so we should probably be there around like 3 o'clock maybe. So... We're gonna hit the road. I already miss her. <sighs> I feel like I'm forgetting something and it's really weird driving in a car without a car seat in the back. So it's okay. I'm just hoping that this weekend goes by super fast and that I can get back to her and not have to leave her for a very, 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 very long time. Back. So we're in this little I'm back. called Cherry Valley. Yep. Cherry Valley, yep. Beaumont, yep. Ukaipa. Yep. And we're staying in these little cottages. We're in the 100 cottages. Yeah, so sure. Yep. And they're 200 years old and they're haunted. Yeah, they're freaking haunted. <sighs> Give the tour, Bean. Alright. So, uh, AC. Some windows. A nice fridge. In the closet. <whistles> the bed. A chair. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> a little desk. And, uh, and the bathroom. The piece de resistance. What does that mean? I don't know. Check it out. That crack almost looks real. It is real. Gives it a rustic. Yeah. Five. Yeah. Oh, look at that light. So, we're gonna get ready for the rehearsal dinner. Yeah. Okay. Alright. So while we're getting ready, check out this footage from around the place. Alright, 
All right. Who did? Off to the dinner. Who Outfit did? of the night. Go yeah. bean. Shirts from. Wait, you should definitely button this. Let's try that again. Shirts from Under Armour. Yep. Jeans from American Eagle. Yep. Shoes from Vans. Vans. Yep. Okay, my turn. Romper from American Eagle. Shoes. Don't know. We're off to the rehearsal dinner. Are you ready? Nope. Does this make you excited for our wedding? We already got married. Mark. In my in my flip. <laughs> Show my flips. We're back to the normal flips. Thank God. No more heels or shoes. <sighs> yeah. Feeling human again. Yeah. Where is it? Not I nice. can smell Not it. Right. <laughs> Thanks, Soda. Oh, there it is. Okay, so we just got back from the campfire and everybody was Googling what exactly makes this place haunted. So I guess a long, long time ago, it was called The Last Resort. Mark! God. It was called The Last Resort and it was like a place that people came to when they were mentally ill and they couldn't get well, they would come here. So I guess there's like a bunch of spirits that still live in here. I know in the lobby, supposedly there's like an old woman with a little boy. So, we might have some guests tonight. <laughs> I'm so scared. <laughs> so anyways, we're going to go ahead and end the vlog here. Thank you guys so much for watching. We'll tell you if anything weird happens uh, in tomorrow's vlog. And we will see you guys then. Hey, bye! Pray for us. <laughs> like, comment, subscribe.